do a client quickly when I came in this morning first um, but I'm gonna take you next door to meet Chris before I give you a tour of the salon because I've got a little bit of a break now um, and you can come and meet crazy Chris my good friend from the post office next door <laughs> I'm not 
over here next weekend. Look. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've dressed up for the occasion. <laughs> I just oh, I said, I just said, <laughs> we're going to go next door and see Crazy Chris. <laughs> and crazy. I walk in and it's la 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 la. <laughs> I'm gonna let her compose herself <laughs> and then I'll come back to you when I've had a cup. Are you feeling better now, babe? Yeah, I feel fine now. She feels yeah. fine now. Just deep breathing. Say hi, Max. Hi. It's all happening in Gilden Sun. So now we've seen Crazy Chris, which uh, you can probably see why I call her Crazy Chris because she's quite crazy in a really nice way and she nicknames herself that. Um, but I thought I'd give you a last look at my salon before I say goodbye to it because um, I've got another client coming in shortly. But here we go, this is obviously my front window. I'll give you a view from outside afterwards. And I've been working here on my own. If I show you my nail desk. I've been working here on my own for um, just over two years now. And it's a lovely, lovely little sound. The lady that's taking over from me is going to be called Decadence um, Nails and Beauty. So look, I love this dresser. I am gonna miss this dresser. I wanted this in the house. I've got my awards cupboard with a few awards up there. Um, obviously they're coming home with me. Um, I have my little training room where I did my teaching. And then through the back of the salon is just the bathroom and the kitchenette. But it's been a really cute little salon. And this is in Gildan Sutton in Chester. So it's nice and because it's um, a really nice little village my clients have all been really lovely, it's local people. And you end up getting a really good relationship. Like with Chris next door, we have um, a really good laugh. And if ever I had like a no-show or a cancellation or a little gap or anything, I'd nip next door to the post office and have a cup of coffee and serve people behind the till, which can really mess with people's heads when they see me in there instead of in here. But um, yes, yeah, so this is my gorgeous salon. And I'll be saying goodbye to it today. Um, and I have got a bit of a glitter addiction just to show you there um, and I will be taking all my 170 gel twos home with me or thereabouts because I will after today I will be a full-time youtuber and blogger which feels a very very strange experience um, at my age to be saying that so one day I'm going to be uploading uh, videos of nail art another I'll be doing hair or beauty and hopefully I'll be able to slip some in with some gel too for the professionals out there that have helped me set up my YouTube from the beginning and were my original followers um, so that'll be really nice to be able to try and give something back to them but I'll probably come back to you in a little bit so it's half past ten at night on the 9th of January 2016 and I have just removed the last traces of Divine by Design from my salon and it feels very emotional and weird because although the, all the same furniture is still here it doesn't seem like my salon anymore which is good because we don't want it to because it's going to belong to Alison from Decadence now and I know she's going to do amazing things with it but just to show you one last time here we go some of the products I've left for her all my awards have gone, my certificates have gone. It's all empty. So, thank you everyone so far for joining me on this part of the ride. I wouldn't be able to be doing this if it weren't for all of you that watch me on YouTube, all of you that follow me. I just want to say thank you to all of you out there who are my um, amazing followers and watchers and subscribers. I couldn't do this if it weren't for all of you. The reason I'm giving up the salon is because YouTube has become so big and so great that I need to give far more time to it than I am. So on to the next part of the journey. Thank you very much. It's been amazing so far and I can't wait to share the rest of my journey with you. Thank you.